we just left Hellsburg and I got a ring. I feel like Beyonce. No, put just a just ring on it. Put a ring on it. I'm so lost without you. Without you. And I, I won't make it without you. It's Wednesday morning. It's wacky weird Wednesday. Wacky weird Wednesday morning, January 27th. Happy Wednesday. Happy wacky Wednesday. It's wacky Wednesday day here, so Ralphie has got to wear all kinds of wacky clothes. We've got different pair, two pairs of different shoes on. Some shorts over his. Okay, Dad, I get it. Pants. Okay, we're gonna fix part of your hair, this part, and we're gonna leave this part laid down, okay? Like a girl? No. We're gonna fix, half fix it, so you're not put together all the way. Because it's wacky weird day, remember? Wild wacky hair. Wild wacky hair. Wild wacky hair. Wild wacky hair, not wild wacky bear. Yes, there you go. Now I look all bright today. <laughs> you look wacky. Parents look uh uh look on the look Paris's tail, it's getting Growing, growing. It's growing. Yeah. Now she's being wacky. She is. Yeah, she's wacky. We wanted to put hair color in his hair because we thought we had some hair color in here, but we don't. Some like the kind you just brush in there, brush it out. Hey. So he'll cat? just go to school like that. I hate going to school like this. Wacky uh, Tuesday, Tuesday. So, then we're going to drop them off at school. I'm going to jump in the shower quick and then we got to finish some of our stuff we have to do today. Before we have to get the kids off to the visit with their dad at 4.30. Found the hair color. Yeah, that they wanted. So now Rafi has some wacky colors in his hair. Wacky? Wacky. Hey, yeah, I look like a girl like this. You like that? Mm -hmm. What's up, guys? It's Wacky Weird Wednesday, and I got the Wacky Weird Kid back there. Bless you. Thank you. You're welcome. So I'm on my way to take him to daycare and then um, go back and get bright and then we gotta go do our shopping. So it's our shopping day. We tried to do it on Tuesdays, but we went out with mom yesterday. So mom and aunt Shirley overrode the shopping day. Even though we did go to Trader Joe's and get stuff, but like I'm talking like Walmart, Price Shopper, Ivy, and all that is what we usually do, but life's been crazy, and I haven't seen Mom and Aunt Shirley forever. It seems like because my mom's been sick, so I've been helping with her, so she's on a four-week break, so we might be able to get to see them more often this next four weeks. So we are out and about now, and getting ready to... I need to wash my car because it's really dirty after all the snow stuff we've had. It's got salt and stuff all over it. So I'm trying the new car wash, the one that Brad went to the other day. 
It's got quite a little, a little line here going on. It's brand new, it just opened up a few weeks ago. So that's probably why. Look at those vacuums, it's kind of crazy, look at it. It's got like a big brown thing and the hose comes out where the vacuum is. So we'll see how they do. The only difference is Brad said that they don't. The other ones we go to that have a nice car wash like this, they have uh, people that wipe your car off when you come out of the car wash. They wipe your windows and wipe all your you know, rear view mirrors and all that stuff off. And they don't have that here. They just have a big dryer. I see people wiping up cars over there. What are they doing? Is that if you pay like detailing. detailing and stuff? So uh, I think the dryer is like a bit better dryer though. So we'll see how well it dries it off. Because sometimes it can leave spots when it's just the dryer. Okay, so I got my car done, and it's not, it didn't do too bad, I guess. I mean, the wheel bright, you can see there, that automatically goes on, which is kind of cool. They, usually they have to wipe that on with like a paintbrush type of thing. A little bit dirty in the inside there, but, and then like right here on the window, it could mend wipe because it's got some water spots sprayed there, kind of dried up. And a few little water spots there, so not too, too bad. That was $15 for that wash, though, and I had a $3, $3 off coupon, so it came to $12. But the other place I normally go to, it's the same amount when I have a coupon. I think it's right around that same amount, and they wipe it all off when you come out real quick and make sure you don't have any water spots, so that place I actually like better. But this is closer, so we'll go here, you know, just every once in a while when we want to uh, get it washed real quick. All right, now we're going into the pet store to get uh, water for the fish tank. Eating at Panera will. Bread. No, I want a salt water tank, but it's so freaking expensive. Brad's over there periscoping. Say hi, Periscope. You're on the vlog. Like that. Like that. Say 
hi, you're on the vlog. We're, you're on our vlog. We are going to get lunch here. We have a little bit left over from our gift card from Stephanie, so I drug Brad over here. He went late, decided to come, and we will get some lunch. Lunch is here. Coming from the food. I got the turkey and kale panini and a vegetable soup. And then Brad got an apple. Oh, and I got bread. Brad got an apple and uh, macaroni and cheese. Bread vlog and it's smoking. It looks good. Now we're at Hellsburg Diamonds. We're looking to see if I can find me a little a wedding ring since I lost my wedding ring. I don't think too fancy because when we get married here, we're gonna get probably new rings. So I just want something because I have no ring at all. So we have this coupon. It's fifty dollars. Just want to get something here. Kind of want just a plain silver one, maybe. We'll have to look and see the prices on some of these. So, we just left Hellsburg and I got a ring. I like Beyonce. Put a ring on it. I put a ring on it. I like it. It's just a simple little ring. Was this sterling silver, wasn't it? Yeah, sterling silver. It actually fits better than my other ring did, so I finally have a ring now. I feel like I'm actually married. No more messing around with the single life for me. Okay, so now I'm gonna stop into uh, White Barn real quick. buy any because they're not on sale right now. I didn't make it out here at the last sale so I'm just going to smell them because I haven't smelled a lot of them. So. And then when they're on sale I'll come back and get the ones I decide I like. Latte squirrel smells so good. That's definitely gonna be one I'm getting. It smells incredible. Brad said they got Puny Wick syndrome going in on their display. <laughs> so long I got sick of it so I, I just can't really do it anymore but I might try to get it eventually because I did used to really like it. I just got so burnt out on it.
Okay guys, I was trying to be ornery and I can't blow this out. It don't blow out. Just can't get it to blow out. White Barn. Now we're headed to go to uh, Price Chopper to get some groceries. And then, um, so I smelled all the new candles. I had all kinds of them there. I really liked Mocha Latte, Mocha Latte Swirl. That was really, really good. It's not like Espresso Bar. It's more like, uh, it's got some coffee in there, but it's got chocolate and cream and coffee mixed together. It's really good. And then um, blueberries and cream. I like blueberries and cream, but it wasn't as creamy as I thought it was going to be. Could, I wish it was a little more creamier, but it smelled pretty good. I'll probably get that and try it. And then um, I liked uh, the ones that I showed you just now on there with the uh, mahogany coconut I liked, um, coconut sandalwood I really liked. I really liked sh uh, Sugar peony petals. I really like that one. That was really good. So I think I got an idea of what I want to get when they go back on sale. She said they're probably on sale probably around then the next few weeks, at least by Valentine's Day or so, they'll have another sale. Either two for twenty-four or twelve fifty, whichever they decide to do. So then I'll go and get some then. Cause I don't pay full price for them. No sir. You got Ralphie from daycare. Who that? Who that? Who that? Ralphie, you always say that. Who that? Who that? Who that? Who that? Who that? Who that? He always says that. He's being rude. You're being rude, Ralphie. Oh gosh. We're just sack in the middle of the road. So. He's mad because we got Starbucks and he didn't get any. Ralphie, we got that like three hours ago. You don't really need all that coffee anyway. Not till you get older. Dad, I didn't mean that coffee. It means something else at Starbucks. Well, you don't need Starbucks all the time either. You're too young for all that. I want some. I know you want some. It's good, isn't it? So, we decided to pick Ralphie up before we go to Price Chopper so we can help um, just pick out his birthday cake so we can see um, what he wants to get for his birthday cake for Saturday. We'll have to order it today and then we'll probably be able to pick it up Saturday, the day of the party. And we will have a nice little cake for the party. And then we still need to go get some uh, plates and things like that too, I think. Look what we've turned him into. He likes to vlog and he likes to drink Starbucks. Hey, are you supposed to vlog in this car, I think? Yes, I am, Mr. Crazy Hair. Hey, can I see your eyes? I can't see your glasses when you have your eye goggles on. You want to see my eyes? It's bright. Then put your glasses on. Thanks. So, look what they have on sale. They have their honey crisp apples on sale for $1.99 a pound. I love honey crisp apples. I've been waiting for them to go on sale. They've been like three, three something a pound, like almost three ninety nine a pound. But they look awful green. They don't look very ripe. They're pretty green, except for the ones in the basket here, are a little more red. I might get the one little bag because they look a little bit better. I think I might do that. You tell me when you see one. You're in the girl section, I think. 
How about that one? No. How about that one? No. Okay. Now, you're almost far up to the boys. Now you're. So he decided on one. He had to narrow down to a couple, a Star Wars one and a car one. But he got the Ninja Turtle one. So that's how it should look. Let's see how it turns out when we pick it up. I think we might get We could do that or we might just do five. Just five candles or something maybe. We'll see. Ralphie got him a car. He wanted a car. Oh, my favorite one. He wanted a car, so we got him a car. I can't say no when it's his birthday week. So, since it's almost six o'clock, we're just going to stop here at Dickie's Barbecue Pit. We haven't ate at this one before. So we're gonna get some din din and chow down. Okay, so we got our food and I got I got little sliders. They were a dollar each. I got three sliders and a baked potato casserole and green beans. Marco got a pulled pork sandwich and waffle no, it's fries. The big barbecue. Big barbecue pulled pork sandwich. And beans. We're off we got a what is it? A little hoagie something? It's a it's like a little slider, but what's the kids know? Beef. Some kind of beef thing. Beef sandwich and macaroni and cheese and Brad got the beans and green beans. And the western something sandwich. It's a western. It's got pulled pork and sausage on there. So I'm just eating the meat off the bread pretty much. You can't have the bread. You can have bread, can't you? It's just not, it's not hard, is it? Oh. Okay guys, it's the end of the vlog for today. Getting ready to head to bed. Brad's already asleep there. Actually, not already, it's pretty late. Pretty late. I had to finish doing yesterday's vlog. We were busy tonight. We went, took the kids to the visit, and then we went to eat dinner, came home, and then me and Brad um, put together some freezer meals. The freezer meals that I showed you a few weeks back, we made four different freezer meals, and we put them in the freezer so they will be ready to go for a quick dinner. So we finished those and then I didn't I didn't start editing the vlog until about 10 o'clock. So got a late start tonight. So I need to hurry up and get to bed so I can get up and go to work tomorrow. So thanks for watching and we will see you all in the next vlog. Good night. So we're home and I thought I'd show you real quick what we got at Trader Joe's. Let's see here, first up. We got some asparagus. They had it for $1.99 for a bundle. So we got a bundle of asparagus. Got some strawberries for Brad's mom because she said she can't find them anywhere. She wants some, so we saw them there. So we got this for her. I got some a dozen macarons.